We realized that despite all the efforts to get the UHC, universal health coverage, right in the world, we didn't really progress uh, as we wanted. We counted on health professionals, but health professionals cannot do everything. Social participation is about civil society organizations, organized people helping the government to reach those that are most in need. And it also is bringing the understanding of different population groups to the government that sometimes are overseen when we prepare the strategies, the plans, the programs in health. I was uh, in charge of tobacco control in my country and it was so difficult to pass the message to politicians to ban, for example, smoking in all closed places. And in my country, young people were working to get some money to support them in their studies in restaurants and bars. And they were exposed to smoke while working there. So this, they thought, was not acceptable and they pass this message to media, to parliamentarians, and immediately they decided, yes, we have to do something. What really matters here is that the governments understand the potential of civil society. And here we need WHO to ensure that we can exchange good practices, because through good practices we can best understand what works and what doesn't.